Hello and welcome to the Sky Stage Ultra Assembly Training video. Here we will demonstrate how to properly perform putting together a Sky Stage Ultra or SSU platform. SSU platforming is completely modular and comes in a variety of lengths, including half, one, one and a half, two, and three meter sections. Sky Stage Ultra platforming is light, easy to use, and requires no tools to assemble as it utilizes stage pins to connect the platform together. The first step to assembling the SSU platforming is starting with the connecting frames or U-frames and two side panels. To start, go ahead and slide the side panels into the U-frames into the channels and pin them on the ends. Ensure that the stage pin is far enough in so that the hole is visible for you to slide the locking pin into place. Once you get the first side in, go ahead and do the second side, ensuring that you use both stage pins, top and bottom of the side panel. In this demonstration, we're going to add an additional section to the platform. You'll notice that there is a shared connection frame in the center. We will repeat the same steps, ensuring that the side panels are placed into the channels of the connecting frame and pin with the locking pin on the other end to ensure that the pin does not slip out. Once the bulk of the frame is put together, one person can go ahead and step inside of the platform, raise it up, and allow the other person to slide the casters into the bottom of the connecting frames where they will then be pinned. In the case of utilizing an end stirrup on the platform, you will use the rod that slides through the end stirrup as the pins for the casters. Also note that when you mount the end stirrup, you have it in the correct formation so that the hoist will show the controls on the inside of the platform as opposed to the outside when mounted. In the case of utilizing an end gate, you will run the same process sliding the casters in through the bottom of the connection frame. However, you will utilize the pin holes for the casters utilizing stage pins. Additionally, the end gate is pinned from the inside out of the connection frame and will be pinned with the locking pin or safety pin on the inside of the channel of the connection frame. Once the frame is completed with the casters in place and either the end gates or the end stirrups on either end, go ahead and lay your flooring down on the ledges generated by the side panels. Once the flooring is down and flat, you will notice that there are hooks on either end of each side panel right inside the toe board where you will press those out to ensure that the floor does not pop out at any given time. The final steps of putting the platform together include putting in your top rail posts, noting that they are adjustable up to three different heights. Ensure that you do make them level running across the platform. Once you lay your top rails in place, go ahead and place those into the U channels and pin those again using the stage pins with the safety pin on the opposite side.